Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. So this movie, even though it's made in the year 2000 or like it releases in the year 2000, I think it talks a lot about the like, the 1900s at least. But at least at the beginning, that's how it portrayed. So, what happened in the beginning, if you saw that small clip, basically the baby kept on crying. She is a newborn, and we didn't see the face of the newborn kid, if, besides that. But, what happened was, so the doctor did like, ask the two ladies that delivered this woman's, like, newborn child or did you like even if it's accidental or not did you drop the this newborn child because apparently what the doctor said is that what we found out towards the end of the first clip is that through the delivery this baby arms and legs were broken during birth and I'm not very sure how that happened but I understand that could happen sometimes so yeah so jumping later on in the plot David Dunn is who is a former star football quarterback Turn security guard is the sole com completely unharmed survivor of a train crash which kills 130 others. After a memorial service for the victims, he found he finds a note on his trial windshield asking if he have ever been ill and inviting him to limited edition, an art gallery operated by Elijah Price, who is this newborn child. Oh, not newborn, who was that newborn, who was a baby in the beginning of the um, episode, the one that you hear the baby crying. So, jumping to the end, David meets Elijah's mother, who explains the difference between villains who fight heroes with physical strength and those who use their intelligence. Elijah asks David to shake his hand, which reveals that Elijah was responsible for numerous high-priced accidents, including David. Is there a name? Elijah. 